part of a great Susan, very Susan, to do whatever he wants, is more realistic. So that's why I wanted to break the recording was because realism. So I tried to use as much real science as I possibly could, which kind of spilled over in the valley because uh, I created a workshop. I read an article in the American in 1992 about uh, uh, nanites, but it was theoretical. And I said, well, that's a better way of getting superpowers than a radioactive spider, right? Yeah. You know? But uh, yeah, I tried to argue with the guys who think that they do it. I said, the problem is I was on the set, right? And I was just like, you guys picked the wrong character, you shouldn't have XO or something. Because, I mean, nanites, everybody has nanites now, you know? Spider Man's custom has nanites. It's old school. You know? So, I tried to just take it one step beyond. And the beautiful thing about Iron Man is when you do more Iron Man movies, you can use the head of all the ones. The rest of the story is all about the start. Well, we'll go more in depth on Iron Man tomorrow for uh, the demon of the bomb tackle with Sir Bob. Uh, any other questions from our audience? Any other questions?
stand and Nico Kaban of from War Video as they guide us through the fascinating world of the Angel Sing for us. Give them all a big round of applause, ladies and gentlemen. So, I mean, at one time I, I did a, a storyboard for George Romero. Oh, it was a, a Marvel project that never happened. But oh. uh, Butch Geis and I, we took the months off and did storyboards for George Romero. We got paid for that, you know. So this is pre X Factor. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah Butch exactly. Yeah. But the, the the point of it is, uh, when you're on quota, they don't care what you're working on as long as you're working. As long as you got an all something your that has a money that has a dollar value to it. So I just have to not be doing Iron Man at the time, and I was done with Hercules. And you had just finished Kung Fu, right? Oh, uh, I had actually been on, uh, I was the regular artist on Captain oh, America. On Captain America, that's right, that's right. Yeah. Well, see, I shows you I don't know anything because I don't read Not comics. Really. Those iconic covers with Wolverine and Cap, uh, I mean, everybody. The, the, the prints are over there if you're going to purchase them. Those are covers that last forever. Uh, yeah, I've got to say, some of my favorite Marvel covers are Mike Zeck covers. Yeah. Because, yeah. I mean, you've been making these, these covers, you, both of you. I thought Yeah, but he covers. draws better than I do. I mean, that's just, it's a matter of opinion, but yeah. you know, they're, they're excellent both. I mean, I'm, I'm so a better happy. writer than you. Oh, but I love the... Uh, <laughs> I'm very thankful for the commission.
the answer if there was a mystery side. Mystery side? Let's give it up, let's give it up. We are Venom! Yeah! Get more energy the second time around. We are Venom. Ganon pa rin sa mga ibigan mo na ng pano! We are Venom. Alright. Henry? We are Venom. Yeah! I think it's a toss-up between you and you, right? Like, uh, that was kind of on equal footing. So guys, thank you so much. We're gonna leave the two of you here. So now what we're gonna do is we're gonna have a death match between the two of you. <laughs> UFC style, no holds barred. No, it's really up to you. If you wanna beat up a little kid. No, I'm kidding. All right, so one more time, we're gonna have to ask you to do We Are Venom. And again, the crowd has to decide via, you know, applause or shouting or whatever. So please let us know. Ready? Let's go. We are Venom! You see that he had like a power pose, pa? I like it, all right. We are Venom. All right. All right. 
you know what? You did great. But I think because he's a kid, he won this one. So congratulations, you got a shake hand there. And you know what, I, I feel like I should give you the shirts that I'm wearing, but then again, that would expose my not so great body. But thank you, Henry, let's give him a big round of applause. Congratulations. Damn, Henry got that down real quick. All right, thank you guys for your participation. We appreciate it. We're gonna
look forward to now. As I mentioned earlier, we do have some exciting prizes up for grabs, including the exclusive shirt that I'm wearing right now, courtesy of our friends from Columbia Pictures. So here's how it's going to be working. Um, I'll basically ask a question. If you have the answer to it, raise your hand. It's really as simple as that. I hope you paid attention to the trailer because a lot, if not all the answers that I uh, are, are basically part of this <laughs> trivia question will be found in that trailer. So let's start off with something absolutely difficult. Super hardest question of my life. Name the actor who plays Eddie Brock in the middle. All right, you were, you were after the first one. You were great. All right, what's his name? Maybe the phrase is, uh, 